if CPS to your door, I think that means if CPS comes to your door over a DV, will they also go to the school to talk to the kids? It, it's hard to know. I have problems with CPS interviewing children without the child at least having a representative there, a guardian. I have a real problem with that, and it happens all the time. Uh, first off, if they knock on my door, I'm not letting them in unless they make an appointment. I'm just not going to do it unless they have the police with them and a warrant. I'm not letting them in. And you, you've got to be, you can be nice about it. Just simply let them know that uh, you're not prepared and that you would like to have some time. You're welcome to talk to them. Tell them, let them know that you want to talk, you want to help, but they need to come back at a time when it's convenient to you. You have a right to do that. You don't have to let them in your home. I'd be really weary to let CPS in my home unannounced. Uh, and they will go see their kids. See your, They will interview the children. Uh, the worst thing you can do if you know they're liable to interview your children, do not tell your children that someone's going to talk to them. Do not tell your, well, you can tell them that someone's going to talk to them, but do not tell them what to say. That'll get you in trouble. That'll make you look guilty. Just let them know, say, hey, Junior, uh, you know, someone might come to the school and talk to you about mommy and daddy stuff. Uh, and so just talk to them and answer their questions. Tell the truth. That's all you got to say. Nothing else. Because anything more than that, you could have some trouble.